Health Check 10 now. Is a hospital really a fun spot for a children's camp? Yes, when it's Hasbro Children's Hospital. Here's Health Check 10 reporter Barbara Moore Silva. For these kids, laughter is proving to be some pretty powerful medicine. The entertainment complements of the Toe Jam Puppet Band. Five-year-old Amaya Devine has cancer. They put, put this little needle into my portal. It hurts. But here at Camp Dottie... It's fun and there's lots of activities to do. And it gets your mind off of the hospital. Yes. Having camp here in the shadow of the hospital just offers an experience for patients and, and siblings to come know that the hospital doesn't have to be a scary place. They come just for play. They don't get poked. They're not getting medicine that's going to make them feel sick. And they get to reconnect, and they reconnect with each other, too. Kelsey Hobbs should know she spent a lot of time at Hasbro as a teenager when she was battling cancer. Now she works here and coordinates Camp Dottie. It's for cancer patients here at the hospital between the ages of four and seven. It's also for their siblings. The siblings are affected just as much as the patient is. Maybe not literally in, as far as getting medication or pokes, but they witness their sibling going through all this. Seven-year-old Carissa is a sibling. I think it's fun and I think there are a lot of great counselors around here who help us learn. Many of the counselors here were cancer patients at one time. Former Miss Rhode Island America Jessica Marfeo, one of them. And I remember being going through treatment and different things and being able to take that week out and relax with other friends that I made at Hasbro as well as counselors. Um, I had acute lymphoblastic leukemia. Does this bring back memories? Yes, very much. A lot. How much did this camp mean to you when you were going through your treatment? Um, a lot. I think it took um, like some stress off my parents especially. Kendra Simaglia never attended Camp Dottie. She was a teenager when she was diagnosed with cancer, but she couldn't resist volunteering as a camp counselor. It's just great to see them. Like, they're so happy and, I don't know, it's just the positive side of the cancer. Camp Dottie was established back in 1996 on the grounds of Hasbro Children's Hospital for kids with cancer who were too sick to attend regular camp and their siblings. It is free because of funding through the Tomorrow Fund, which is a nonprofit organization that provides support both emotional and financial to kids with cancer and their families. And that's Health Check. Barbara Morsova, NBC 10 News.